Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be my birthday haul, so let's get right into it. So I'm going to just jump right in. I have a lot to cover. I, this is like a collective haul for the whole month, I guess. Um, first, I'm going to start with what my hubby got me. He got me the Crayola Super Tips. There's 50 in this pack, and I love the variety of different colors there are. It's amazing. I love this so much. It doesn't bleed through the pages. I'm trying these out, and I love them so far. The next thing he got me was the Polaroid Zip. This is a mobile photo printer. Looks like that. And I absolutely love it. It works with the Bluetooth. All you have to do is put on your Bluetooth on your, on your phone. I have a Samsung phone, and it just works perfectly so you just turn it on with this button right here you hold it down for a couple seconds and then it starts to blink and that means it's ready to go and you just Bluetooth any picture from your phone and it'll just print it out and it's it's awesome there is 10 photo sheets and they are also stickers so I stick them on my planner or wherever you want to put them like it's fantastic I love this little thing it's awesome so thank you honey I just wanted to let everybody know that he made it safely over there into Korea and I miss him so much already. I've got tons of makeup so let's get into that. The first thing you know that Sephora every year gives a free birthday gift so I went to Sephora first and I got three samples. I got the Cover FX Blot Drops. I got the Kat Von D Locket Foundation in number 62. I'm going to try it out and see if I like it. The Cover FX Some Light. So I'm going to try those out. I also cashed in my points, my Sephora points, and I got this Bare Minerals Gin Nude Matte Lip Color. So that's what this one looks like. And it's in the color Swag. And it is a really deluxe kind of sample. Really nice. I love the color. It's kind of the same color as my nails. It's a really pretty mauve pink color. So I love that. It's very pretty. I also got the free gift, which was the Marc Jacobs Sephora Beauty Insider. You got a mini lipstick and an eyeliner. This is what it looks like right here. It has a little button here that you push and to open it. And it is a very pretty color. Can't wait to try that one out. Very pretty. And this is just a nice basic black eyeliner I'm going to try out. This sample, this is by the Vita Labrita Luxury Tan. This is the body blur. I wanted to try this out, like, but I'm already tan. I just wanted to try this on my legs or whatnot. I have spider veins, kind of, and I'd like to cover it with this. It's 24 hour wear. It's a instant HD skin finish. So this is what it looks like. So I'm going to give it a try. I hope it's pretty good. This is the Sugar Glow Polishing Mask. So I might just to try this out. It smells really good. It's just a sugar mask, so I'm going to try this out. It's supposed to brighten. It's supposed to cleanse, deep cleanse, smooth, and brighten your skin. Double size Too Faced Hangover RX. I, I love this primer, so I decided to get a travel size of it. You know, so I don't have to bring the big, you know, sized one. So that's what it looks like. Um, I think that was it from Sephora. Yeah. The next place I went to was Ulta. They give you this for free. This is the Urban Decay. It's your birthday. Don't do anything I wouldn't do, which is very cute. So, this is what they gave you. It's the Urban Decay eyeshadow. It's very, very nice. I love the packaging. It's so beautiful. It's in a purple color. It's in the shade Midnight Cowboy. And I'll swatch it. 
It's very, very pretty. Oh my gosh. Look at how pretty that is. It's gorgeous. I also got a $10 off anything in the store. So, um, I was contemplating getting the It's Cosmetic Celebration Foundation. I think it was like $35 for just a little compact. I'm going to look and see if I can get it on eBay, maybe cheaper down the line. But I went ahead and picked up this Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer. This looks like the same shade from the It's Cosmetics. It was pretty darn close. I swatched them side by side and they're pretty much the same thing. So it is in the color bronzer. I've heard a lot of people talking about this, but it's not really a bronzer because it's, it's extremely light, first of all, I mean. So I'm thinking I could just use this all over the face as like a powder. So that's what it looks like. I don't even know if you can really see it. Yeah, it kind of blends right into my skin. So it's a very nice powder for all over the face. It does have a huge amount of fragrance to it. It smells just like tan suntan lotion, which doesn't bother me too much, but it is overpowering. So if you're sensitive to smell, I wouldn't recommend you try this out. But they had a sale, buy one, get one, 50% off their Maybelline products. So I bought the Falsies Push-Up Drama Mascara. I love this mascara. I used it one time and I just went right back to it. It's amazing. It's in the shade Very Black and it's waterproof. I love this mascara. It's awesome. It just grips all the lashes and I love the volume it gives. Second Maybelline product I bought was the Graffiti Nudes palette and it looks so nice. I love these colors. Color varieties are beautiful. They have this beautiful teal color. This green looks like it's a dupe for Makeup Geeks Insomnia pigment. So I just wanted to try these out. I mean, I love the color range. So that's them swatched. Very nice. So I'm going to try them. Very nice. So I'm anxious to try this palette out and see. The next thing I got was the Maybelline Superstay Better Skin. I got it because it has a salicylic acid, which is great for acne. I got it in the shade Natural Beige number 50. Uh, it's pretty close to my skin tone. So I used it on my skin today and I think it's really good. It gives you a flawless coverage. So I'm liking it so far. It has a very big mirror, by the way. But yeah, and it comes with this little spongy thing. I don't think I'm going to use that though. I just used my powder brush. But it's very, very nice. I like it. I have no complaints so far. The next thing I bought was this right here. I heard a lot of things about this Essence highlighter. This thing was only $5. It's in the shade Be My Highlight and oh my gosh, when I swatched it in the store, absolutely beautiful. It's stunning. I love it. That's the color right there. It's so gorgeous. Four or five bucks. So I'm absolutely in love with this. Two things from Target. I've never tried the Pixie brand, but I went ahead and tried this out. This is the Pixie Makeup Fixing Mist with Rose Water and Green Tea. It's supposed to be really good for oily skin, and I've used it already. I used it today, and I love it. First of all, the fragrance is amazing. A hydrating antioxidant pore tightening hydrant, which is really great too. Make sure it minimizes your pores and it gives you some hydration, which is awesome. So I'm loving it so far. It's amazing. And this is the Pixie Color Correcting Concealer. This is supposed to be a dupe for the Becca Brightening Concealer. That one is like $30, I think, and this one was only $12, so which is not bad at all. I have it in the shade Brightening Peach, so I'm anxious to try this out and see if I like it. I love the packaging. I love this mint green. It's so pretty. I think the packaging is amazing, what she did. I just got a few things from Walmart. This is the Milani Moisture Lock with Coconut Oil Infused Lip Treatment. My lips have been so dry lately, so I wanted to give this a try. It's infused with vitamin E 
alleviates cracking and dryness. So I'm going to give this a try. Very nice packaging. I love the applicator. It has a big, thick kind of applicator. So I'm anxious to try that out. So it is in the shade number one, Moisturizing Almond Coconut. The next thing I got was something for my planner. This is so darn cute. It's a keychain bag charm and it has three little pom-poms on it. I thought it was too gorgeous. So I picked it up. It was only $3 from Walmart to put on my planner. I received this for my birthday. It is a little, it says Better Naked. It's by Ruby Kisses. It's a long wear long wear HD color eye eyeshadow palette and these are the colors right here very cute and one of the shades says birthday suit which is really really cute the colors are bare birthday suit stripped stark naked exposed and unclawed so I thought that was super cute thank you so much I love you if you're watching this. So I love getting makeup for my birthday. It's just, <laughs> I love it. I also received this blending and contouring oval soft and smooth brush. It's an extra large, perfectly and evenly magic collection. I've been dying to try one of these brushes out and I got one for my birthday and ooh, I can't wait to try it out. So I got that. I also got one of these cute little love boxes. It says Glam Girl, Sparkle, Diamonds, Fashion Trend, Chick, Lipstick, Shine. I love that. So I'm going to put little stuff in there. It had um, my birthday sash in it. So I was so excited for that. So, so I'm anxious to try these products out. I might do a video like a first impressions on all this stuff if you'd like to that those are all the things that I got for my birthday I'm gonna go into what I got at Dollar Tree the first thing I scored at this Dollar Tree finally found the wet n wild photo focus eyeshadow palettes um, this one is in the shade Newport Nights nice and I got this one it's called mixing metals I found this one. It's Blue Eyed Soul. They also had this one, which was Desert Festival, and I already had it already. So I just went ahead and just just to show y'all. The next thing I found was another eyeliner. It's in the shade Violet Femme, Feminine. It's the On Edge liner. So I love those liners. They had some lipsticks there. I have Fergie Daily. Yes. I already have that one, but I'm going to swatch it for you guys. I'm not sure if I'm going to put it in the giveaway or whatever. So this one is Fergie Daily. If you can hardly see, it's kind of a nude. They also had Bobot Love. I also had that one, and I love this color. It's very, very beautiful. So there's Bobot Love and Fergie Daily right there. Fusionista, I guess. <laughs> so that's what it looks like right there. It's a very pretty color. Oh my gosh. I don't have this one. I've never owned this one, so I was excited for that. The next thing they had was this Perfect Pout Lip Gloss. It's in the shade, I have no idea. There's, there's no shade on here, but I like it because it's kind of a metallic color. So, I'll try that out. I bought some more of these LA Color Color Craze Gel ones, and this one is called Bedazzled. It's like what I have on my nails, but this one is the one that I have. It's called Mademoiselle. So, I'm not sure if these two are the same color, but this is what I put on my nails. So, yeah, these are what the products compared side by side so I love these um, I'm just gonna keep getting the little ones I mean I really like them they're great for traveling so I just wanted to just get them as a collection 
This one is called Chill. And this one is called Facetious. So I got those three. I bought some more LA Color Drama Lashes in the 976 Diva. And I love them. I'm wearing them on my eyes today. They're absolutely amazing. They're great. No complaints there. Uh, Four dollar. They're great. I bought one, two, three, four, five, six. I bought six of them. So I'm definitely going to go back and get some more just because so I don't have to buy lashes for like a, a year, which is great. <laughs> so I also picked up this Duo Eye Shadow Pencil. It's really pretty colors. So I'm going to try this one out. I think there's no shade on here. One's a taupe and one is a champagne color. I finally found these nice and clean deep action cleansing cloths. These are the orange ones. I've tried the green ones, the purple ones, the blue ones, and now I found the orange ones. So I'm super excited. I don't know if these are kind of acne kind of treatment. They kind of remind me of the acne, the clean and clear acne ones. They seem to be okay. They're just makeup remover wipes, and I love these. They're really super thick, and they just do the job of getting everything off. So I like them. The next thing I found was a box, the Fox box. I was looking for this for the longest, and this is what the back looks like, and this is what the front looks like. So adorable. Just a nice box. So I think I'm going to put my markers in them, my 50 Crayola markers in there. I don't know. It would be so cute just to store them in this little thing. So, and they also had like a little one, a little miniature one of the same pattern. I think there's more out there, like a dog or something like that. I'm going to keep looking for them. The next thing, uh, I think I hauled this in my last haul was the hashtag. I just wanted to show you what it looked like with batteries in it. So, that's what it looks like. It's very bright. So, I'm going to go back and get the star one when I find it again. The next bag, two of these LED pumpkin lights. I just love these. I buy these every year. Um, I packed up the other ones that I had, so I went ahead and bought two more. I'm probably going to just hang them like I did these um, butterfly ones. So there's ten lights in each one. So I got two packs of those. I finally found this Disney Princess pencil pouch and it's like a clear I love that so it's really cute it says I am a princess on it and I love it I adore it so I don't know what I'm gonna put in this maybe it's like markers or whatever my planner got these right here these are the sassy and chic nails I haven't seen this design so I picked these up I found this stylus pen in a neon pink color. I found three packs of these color therapy markers for the adult coloring books. So I'm anxious to try this out on my coloring books, the adult ones. I bought two packs of tool. I wanted to make uh, paper clips or something. You know those little paper clip things out of these. So I got this gorgeous purple and orange one. I love it. And I got the orange one. So I have a bunch, a bunch of stickers here. I found these for Halloween. Too cute to pass up. These um, are kind of raised, they're kind of like the puffy kind, and some of them are just regular stickers. So I got those. And these have the googly eyes. I bought two of these cupcake ones because I don't know when I'll find them again. Both of them. Love it. I got these happy birthday banners. I thought I can use that for my planner. And I got this 
happy birthday, make a wish, happy birthday, sending you smiles on your special day. And another happy birthday set. And I found this three-in-one cotton travel set. It comes with uh, Q-tips, cotton pads, and um, cotton balls. This is great for traveling. I just thought, wow, there's 50 pieces in this thing. So you can just throw this in your bag. It's already like zipped. I mean, it has like a cute Ziploc closure to it. You can just throw this in your bag with you when you travel. Awesome. I bought another pom pom. This one is in the leopard. You know, I'm, I love leopard. So I went ahead and bought it. As if I needed another one. I think I'm just going to collect all the colors they have. I also found this washi tape in like a vintage looking color. Very pretty. This is the last thing I got from Hobby Lobby and it's the Happy Planner stickers. It has six sheets and these are the stickers right there. I believe that's everything for my birthday haul. I want to thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you have subscribed already and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!